I'm here to share some breaking news with you, and that is RMC is merging with Larson International to form one company so they can now build super loops for every park out there in existence. Now, are you excited about that? I'm trying to control my excitement here, but it's really hard to do so. So what does this merger mean for RMC and Larson International? According to the press release, RMC and Larson are merging to form a powerhouse in the roller coaster and amusement industry. The new organization will provide a broader ride portfolio and generate synergies between business development, engineering, and manufacturing in a streamlined back office. The new organization will continue to operate out of Idaho and Texas, so that's not going to change there. And there's no planned changes to the staffing for both companies as of now. It also says that the two companies will combine engineering and R&D efforts to drive innovation. And here's a look at the full press release of this very exciting news. And if you do not know, Larson International has built zero roller coasters. So unfortunately, this move will not get us to ride an RMC T-Rex sooner. But the good news is RMC is really looking to grow because now technically they'll be able to add flat rides to parks as well as high speed insane roller coasters. And even though Larson International has been around much longer than RMC, I think we all know that RMC is the bigger company here when it comes to revenue and profits. But what does this mean for the future of both companies and does it mean that we might see better rides in the future? Now, before I share my thoughts with you, here's a few samples of my coaster merch that you can find in the official Theme Park Predictions merch store. So if you're looking for some cool coaster merch to wear while you're at the parks, be sure to check it out. Now, as I take a look at the ride portfolio that Larson International offers, it's mainly family and carnival rides like the Super Loop, Larson Flying Eagles, as well as a Drop Tower, and some other fun looking flat rides. So nothing's really there that really excites me as far as, you know, new innovative stuff. However, I am very curious to see exactly how both of these companies form together to create new rides and new roller coasters and so forth. But for me personally, I'm really, this move's very interesting to me because RMC is clearly trying to grow. And when any type of company's growing, that's a great sign for them as well as the industry that it's in. And honestly, I do not know enough about Larson International, but who knows? Maybe they have some financial issues and this is a way for them not to go bankrupt. But I predict that with this move and new flat rides coming to parks and more revenue coming in for both of these companies, since they're going to be one eventually, it's great news for RMC because I really feel like they can even make more coasters in the long term as well as grow their business even more which means, again, more super loops for every park out there. Um, obviously, I'm joking. Hopefully, we get more RMC single roll coasters and hybrids and iBox track coasters. But what we really want is just the RMC T-Rex. So please, God, please, coaster gods, and whoever you pray for, whoever you believe in, just uh, let's all come together because we really need a brand new RMC T-Rex coaster to be built because we all know that we're very intrigued by this concept and we really want to ride it. So hopefully this merger means that the RMC T-Rex is more of a reality sooner than later and we'll be able to ride one very soon. But overall, I think this is a very smart move for both companies and I'm excited for the future of RMC and Larson International working together because I'm all for more flying eagle rides coming to parks all across the world. So now that you know my thoughts, what are your thoughts? What do you think about this? What does it mean for both companies and the future of roller coasters from RMC? Be sure to let me know in the comments. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Remember to smile today, think positive, and keep riding coasters.